So 2020 is over, 2021 is the year of the ferret. Now, you're probably familiar with the ferret Wi-Fi. It is the classic, the OG, the Wi-Fi connected inspection camera you can put at the end of your fish sticks and get to wherever you can't get yourself. Nice, compact, neat little kit. Now, there's three new models coming out this year and the ferret Wi-Fi is being replaced with some upgrades. So, there's three. The Ferret Lite, which is a new entry model, the Ferret Pro, and then we have the Ferret Plus with the most extra features that you're going to love. So we're just going to go through all of them, going to compare, we're going to show a chart, you know, all, the, all that stuff. Let's see it. So let's take a peek at the Ferret lineup. Now I've got three cases out here. Uh, currently, there's actually four because the Ferret Wi-Fi is the older version. I've got it in place of the Ferret Pro because it actually looks like that version and it's a little bit similar in features, but we'll go through that. So quickly, we open it up. Same style case between all of them. And we've got the light, the Wi-Fi in place of the Pro, and then the Ferret Plus here. We'll start off with the light. The light is a more basic unit. It's uh, your fish stick actually enters in on the end here, cap instead of having a section built into the top. It's got the built-in lighting and everything. Nice and easy to connect. It comes with a couple connectors on it. You've got the cables, you've got all the adapters, the flexible shaft that's going to be on everything, but it has these special plastic hooks on here. Oh. Sorry, I was off camera for that. So they mount in here, and then there's a locking mechanism just comes in here. So that's the hook, and there's also a magnet one. Nice and simple. It is right in front of your view, but it's the more basic unit, and it's actually killer in terms of the price point on it. It's fantastic. Going up to the Pro, you've got the same kind of kit that you had with the Ferret Wi-Fi. You just end up with a couple more features. Uh, so the Ferret Lite takes one and a half hours to charge. When you go up to the Pro and the Plus, we're down to one hour. You have the ability to change the Wi-Fi channel and the resolution starting on the Pro and going up to the Plus. Also variable focus on these two where this is a fixed focus. So that's kind of the next step up there. And the Ferret Plus has that mount up here so you can put the attachments at the front. You get the metal hook, the magnet on here, flexible shaft, straight shaft, and the cable is uh, included. I've just got it on my desk there. Over to the Plus. Now the Plus ends up with more of a metallic finish on it so it's a little bit easier to spot. So we get in focus. And it's actually a, it's kind of a nice knurled button or cap on the end there. So it's keeping that same shape. So you do have the, the hook and the other attachments, same kind of way, uh, same USB connector, but you end up with a couple more features uh, stepping up from where the Pro was. So you have onboard memory. So if you're running it down a pipe and you drop it into water, like it goes into water, it is you know, rated for that, but if it goes underwater, since it's Wi-Fi direct transmission, it would lose the signal. So at this point here, it's recording. So you can gain, get that back and you can download and watch it. The, it also has a built-in non-contact voltage meter, which is a very sweet feature to have on it. So if you come up to live wires, you'll see it in the app. Also, in terms of accessories, there's the ferret stick telescoping stick. You can thread it on the end there. Do not use it to whack people in the knees. And ferret armband, ferret wristband. So you can actually have your phone wrapped onto your arm. So it's nice and easy. It's hands free because your hands are going to be busy fishing the stick and everything. So we're going to connect in. I've already got it connected via Wi-Fi. So we're already connected on here. And this is running off a very slow iPad, so it is a little bit laggy. But we're gonna just take a quick peek at some of the fine features here on here. Uh, the Wi-Fi channel settings, so this is for the Pro and the Plus, you have that. 
Uh, you can switch the resolution, 720, 360. And non-contact voltage detector is right there. Audible alarm for the non-contact voltage detector. Storage location, both. Allows you to record right onto it. And display mode. This is a neat feature. I'm going to put it on always up around. Okay. So I've engaged a new feature, the always up round feature. Now, this feature allows you to rotate the camera, as I'm doing right here, but it keeps it oriented up. So you can see the hook rotating. That hook is attached to the camera. This is on the light. So this allows you to rotate a hook, but it doesn't get you as dizzy. And using this round setting here is a, a little bit more comfortable with it. So neat feature. And that's a feature that's new to all the new Ferret products. Yeah. And that's it. If you have any questions, feel free to email us, sales at thenextstepagency.com, or check out our website, www.thenextstepagency.com. You'll see a round button here for subscribe, and you'll also see a video suggestion here if you'd like to keep watching. Thank you very much. Have a great day. Bye.